work bans limiting the amount of hours per week that international students can work in Australia are being reintroduced in July 2023. G'day and welcome to this International Student Life. We tell stories and our story is international student education and we have some important news and an update uh, for those of you who are currently overseas and looking to apply to Australian universities and an Australian work visa. Well, there's some big changes coming up and let's see what it is that from July 1st, 2023, the current government led by Anthony Albanese, the Prime Minister, they are going to reintroduce a limit on the number of hours you can work per week in Australia. You will only be allowed to work 24 hours a week while you are studying uh, as an international student here in Australia. Now currently there is no Stop. limit and that's been uh, the case since January 2022 last year when the previous Australian government led by Prime Minister Scott Morrison, uh, they removed all restrictions on the number of hours per week. So let's look into the reasons for this. Now, um, it, was, it was designed to encourage a lot of international students to come back to Australia and study because uh, during COVID, of course, Australia's borders were closed and the university sector in Australia was absolutely decimated because not all international students were able to stay in Australia because, of course, they had no support, they couldn't work, a lot of them, and many, many international students went back to their home countries. Now, the other thing was that um, in their home countries, a lot of them found uh, studying online uh, was although it was available a lot of them dropped out of their courses because they simply couldn't cope doing their studies under those situations. That was why the previous Australian government decided to encourage applications from university students but they wanted to make it easier for these students uh, to get back into the country once the borders open and, in, and get those uh, university enrolments back to the previous levels before COVID. Now unfortunately a consequence of this has been that a number of universities are already tightening their vetting processes for student applications and in some cases some of these universities have banned or restricted students now we'll do a separate episode outlining which universities these are but we want to keep this as uh, short and sharp as possible for you and uh, the reason why these unis are already tightening their application vetting processes it is believed that there are fraudulent ap applications and they've actually become more prevalent since January last year when that 20 per hour week work limit on international students was lifted. Wise Words Media is always looking for, for great stories about international students in Melbourne and we're always keen to share any, any uh, story of any student here that we think uh, might be helpful to those. Uh, you might be currently overseas just trying to decide whether to come to Australia. Thanks for listening, thanks for watching and we'll chat to you soon. This international student life is produced by Wise Words Media. This episode contains new paid promotions all information in this episode is taken from sources available to the public in the public domain. Wise Words Media accepts no responsibility for any errors or omissions of information in this episode.